I'm just outside the psychiatric ward. Jesus said, go and make disciples of all the nations. And that includes prison visitations, visiting people in psychiatric wards, you know, dark places where the majority of mankind does not want to go. But Jesus wants to go because he wants to bring light to the darkened souls of man. So I've come to visit someone. Actually, I've just left the prison visitation where um, uh, we're discipling uh, people through discipling prisoners through prison visitations uh so now i'm outside the psychiatric ward i come to visit another person who was also living in the area of Aziannis in uh, cyprus where we opened the discipleship's house and the discipleship school um, many of them were sent to prison one particular person was um sent to a psychiatric ward because uh because and so I've come to visit him, disciple him through visitation. And God wants all of his children. God wants that no one perish, but that everyone come to repentance. And Jesus said, go and make disciples of all the nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and of the Holy Spirit. And instructing them to walk in the ways that I have commanded them to walk. And so I'll keep you updated. So I just uh, uh, got out of the um, uh, psychiatric uh, institution. Uh, as I was walking uh, for visitation, I passed by the uh, ward where they hold the females. Just to, I wasn't sure where the en where the entrance was since the last time I was here. And this one of the um, uh, patients in there was a, a female. She came to the door. And there was a plastic glass thing that separated us. That was the, the entrance. And she ran to the door. And, and we started talking. I said, this is a great opportunity for her to receive Jesus Christ. I said, you want to receive Jesus? She said, she said yeah. Mm -hmm. So she did. And, and she confessed Jesus as her Lord and Savior. We, she invited Jesus into her heart. And then I prayed for the Holy Spirit to come down on her. And then I had a, a Bible in my hand. I said, you want it? And she went like that. She said, yeah, I want it. So I was looking for the nurse, uh, uh, knocking on the door for the nurse to open so I can give this uh, patient a uh, uh, Bible. No one came. I had to leave because <coughs> I was going to visit the male, the guy who I came to see initially. So I went to the, the other ward where they keep the males and we went in and we started talking. We we're praying. We did a healing. We did deliverance in there. And I said, can I give this Bible to the female that I saw in the next ward? He said, but I want it. And I said, I'll bring you one in a few days. Uh, and, and he said, OK, give, give give it to her. At the end, um, uh, he opened the Bible to randomly um, uh, a verse and he opened to um, Matthew 11, where Jesus said, um, uh, I take on your load, something like that. Wait a minute. 